Sup. Today, I'm going to be showing y'all how to record a voice, make it a tag for your beat like this. Alright, and to do that, well, how I do it, one of the ways is I have this as my interface, Focusrite Scarlet 8i6, then I have a Shure SM57 microphone, and then I have an XLR cable. You plug the XLR cable into the microphone, and then you plug it into this, or this, or there's some on the back, and that allows you to record a voice in FL Studio. Alright, but I can't do it because while I'm recording, I have to stick to my computer's main sound driver. I can't go to the scarlet one so I can't record a voice on video but just for the sake of it it'd be like Santa oh my god all right and so you would get this Santa! Oh. actually we get in my regular voice but pretend this is my regular voice all right. Santa! Oh my God! All right. You would uh pitch it up, but for me it's already pitched up because I don't have the original that I recorded. It was actually my little brother that recorded it for me. And you would get this. All right. Frick. Santa! Oh my God! Santa! Sa you would link that. So, uh, well, first you would record it in Edison. All right. You'd, or whatever, and you would put it in FL Studio, okay? You drag it into FL Studio as an audio clip, and then uh, you put it on a mixer track. I already have it pitched up, and it already has delay and all that. But basically, put reverb, put delay, whatever, oh my and. You'd, uh, how I did my specific tag is I chopped the s s s s the s s s s s I chopped that part up. So grab the slice tool, cut what I. I'm a snap, go to none, just so I can get a real close cut. S s s s. And then. Actually, I think I did like this. And how I did the tape stop effect is I went and used a uh, glitch, glitch two. My phone went off. That was Chris. Uh, shouts out to Chris. Uh, they have a a whole bunch of different stuff. You can get this, I think, for a hundred bucks. I'm not sure. Might be less. Might be like fifty. I don't know. But anyway, you put a bar of tape stop right there. Right click this. Create automation clip. And make it be like that. Actually, I take that back. No automation clip. Messing up. got to do the eight beats and then bring it over here Santa! Oh my God! gotta bring Santa! it over here oh my God! so anyway you would play with the tape stop like Santa! Oh my God! you'd make it longer That's how you do it. Um, I messed up a lot in this tutorial, but I'm not gonna record it, re-record it. But you get the idea. You record a voice, and then you chop it up like that, and then for a tape stop, uh, you would just have it like that so you might be able to do it like this Santa! Oh my God! Santa! Santa! Oh my God! No. 
But anyway, it's like that. How long have we been recording? Five minutes? That's close enough, huh? So anyway, you record a voice, chop it up, pitch it up, pitch it down, reverb, delay, then you add it in your beat. When you're done, by the way, use Edison. And then it's like this. So yeah. There you go.